that has had success at home more than they've had on the road. They knew that the last time out in Ottawa. He passes, but he looks like he's looking for a direct shot here. Catalano with the three-man wall in front, sent in with the left and in! Mikey Ambrose with the left late in the fifth minute. Early goal for the Stripes, and that can get everything off on the right foot. Mikey Ambrose has been taking notes from Kevin Kratz in training. Goes with the left. Kello Aiden Daniels trying to work. Near side sends it in with the left. Wide open and into the net for Toronto FC2. We're tied at ones in the 17th. Out of activity in the middle third. Romario with it. Tries to go around, players right foot and just knocked out wide of the net by Catalano. Big save for Toronto FC. Goes around Wyja in a hurry. Ooh. Goes around a lot of different bodies in a hurry. Gallagher at the far, looking into the box. Who's going to be there to take it? Big touch! And in the back of the net, Romario Williams. Ambrose skying and spying. What's he going to do with the left? Send it in. Big switch in the back of the net again! He will in the corner, keeps it inbounds on the end line. Big push from the back. Yep. And it's in the back of the net. Daniels puts it right down the middle. In a give and go here. Akinola's got a bit of a run. The wind behind him tries to chip it into the middle and in the back of the net. We are tied. Luca Uccello. But the Stripes will inbound. There's Romario. Left foot chip, looking for activity at the back. Gallagher spins it down and into the net! Minute 61, seven goals on the board. And in alone, big kick save that time. It's sent in the back of the net. How about goal number eight? Headed away. Trying to work action on the end. Right foot and in! And Metcalf. Not much time left. Boscovic tries to get in the box, picked up, top of the circle, blocked. Another opportunity, Boscovic is there and he missed. Boscovic with the opportunity for a late, and I mean late, equalizer, unable to put it on frame. Hildebrandt was right there, might have been able to save it anyway. Final whistle, Toronto players collapse all over the field.